Hi guys, uh, <laughs> it's Vicky May here. Uh, just want to say welcome uh, back to my channel. Um, I just wanted to do a quick video uh, in regards to how to transfer your images and videos from your Sony A5000 to your iMac. Uh, I know uh, I was searching online for a lot of people for uh, to, I was searching online to see if people had the same issues I was having when attempting to try to figure out how to transfer uh, videos and images uh, due to the recent update. Uh, through my research, I found out that Play Homes, uh, I'm sorry, Play Memories, the home desktop no longer exists effective March 31st, 2020. Sony, they got rid of it. So, uh, even when you try to download, like even it lets you download it, but even when you try to open the app, it no longer works now. Uh, I think I have the, uh, application or software update of 1015 Catalina, I believe. So I just wanted to do a quick video to show you uh, now how simple and easy it is to transfer your images from your Sony A5000 to your computer. So uh, first and foremost, you wanna make sure you get your handy dandy camera, make sure it's on and charge, obviously. And then you're just gonna simply plug up your USB. Uh, either you can get your USB from either uh, I think Sony still sells USB cords. If not, you could just get it on Amazon or Best Buy. I'm pretty sure they have still you have those USB cords. This USB cord, I use this with my uh, PowerShot G7 uh, Canon X Mark II. One USB cord works for both of my cameras, which is awesome. But uh, yeah, this works with the Sony A5000. So if you have one, you could you should be able to use it with that same camera. But all in all to say, uh, simply all you do is plug it up. Once you plug it up, plug it up and turn your camera on, this prompt, you should see this prompt. Play memories, go to sony.net forward slash PM. You don't have to go to that website uh, since even if you download it, it no longer works. All you simply do is literally just plug it up. Once you plug it up, open up your finders folder. So just go to your finder folder and you'll see two uh two locations what you want to do is click on uh usually this uh you you should see uh two folders one that says pm home and then one that says no name i changed mine to sony a5000 mainly because i wanted to you know make it easier for me to know which folder to click on once you click on the sony a5000 you'll see a folder that says private Click on that private folder and then you'll see a folder that says AVCHD. Once you click on that folder that says AVCHD, all of your videos and everything on there will appear. And uh, when you click on the clip, oh, click on the clip and hit OK, it pops right up. And What's up, y'all? And it um, works. So, just wanted to make a quick video because I know some probably somebody's probably out there struggling just like I was to figure out what happened. Come to find out, Sony got rid of or discontinued the Play Memory software effective March 31st. So, quick bummer, but you know now it's a little bit easier just plug and play basically. So. Thanks for watching this video, guys. If you want to see more quick how-to videos, uh, definitely uh, click the link and uh, click the subscribe button as well as the bell notification so you'll be notified of any more videos that drop. Uh, yeah, thanks, guys. Enjoy your day.